Spain is currently grappling with the devastating impact of Storm Dana, which brought severe flooding and a destructive tornado to the country's south and eastern regions on Tuesday, October 29. The storm unleashed historic rainfall levels, exceeding 200 mm in some areas, transforming entire streets into rivers and triggering widespread disruptions. With the storm's heavy rain and strong winds inundating municipalities and leaving roads cut off, the affected regions are now under strict weather alerts. Boa, primo! Pues ven para que así, eh! Bravo, bravo, bravo. ¿Qué grabas, idiota? ¿Qué grabas, primo? ¡Mamá mía! Authorities have warned people to stay indoors and avoid all non-essential travel as emergency services work to contain the damage. The worst hit areas include the regions of Valencia, Castilla-La Mancha, and parts of Andalusia, each struggling with extensive flooding and dangerous conditions. <laughs> In Valencia, Storm Dana's impact has been particularly severe. The storm's relentless rain has flooded numerous residential areas, leaving towns inundated. <laughs> In two, the water levels rose high enough to reach low-lying houses, sweeping away parked vehicles and forcing residents to seek refuge. Streets in the towns of Lombay and Catadau have become clogged as emergency responders have worked tirelessly to rescue residents and drivers trapped in vehicles by the swiftly rising floodwaters. Distressing footage shared on social media has shown the extent of the devastation, including images of a police car being swept away by floodwaters as rescuers tried to respond to those stranded by the flood. The storm's strength has transformed usually quiet streets into dangerous torrents, challenging the emergency teams that are already stretched thin. The heavy rainfall in Valencia was accompanied by a rare and destructive tornado that touched down in a nearby village. Video footage captures the tense moments when debris was lifted high into the air as the tornado passed over a petrol station, with people scrambling to take cover inside the building. The tornado's winds were so powerful that it sent chairs, tables, and other objects flying around an apartment terrace, where they crashed against terrace doors, 
nearly breaking through. The storm and tornado combined have left parts of Valencia's residential and commercial areas in disarray, creating a dangerous situation for anyone caught outside. Ay, Dios mío. Esto es una puta locura. Spain's state weather agency issued the highest level of alert for the eastern region of Valencia, and a secondary level of alert was put in place for Andalusia in the south. Authorities in these areas have coordinated a large-scale emergency operation to manage the severe flooding, assist those affected, and prevent further incidents. Firefighters in Valencia were dispatched to address over 150 incidents caused by the storm's impact. In Carlet and other nearby towns within the Valencia region, schools, courthouses, and essential services were suspended to protect residents and workers from the severe weather conditions. In the Valencian town of Alzira, flooding reached new heights with emergency crews and firefighters assisting residents and rescuing those who became trapped in vehicles along waterlogged street. The situation on the roads has become so hazardous that several routes are completely inaccessible, isolating towns and limiting access to aid. <laughs> Emergency personnel continue to monitor the area closely as the threat of additional rainfall looms, with forecasts warning that weather instability could persist through the weekend, raising the potential for further flooding.